Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. How you doing? This is uh, Studio Ray. This is, uh, I got another segment, Boys and Their Toys. Uh, this part of the segment is about tools, um, electronics, uh, toys that, that we guys enjoy buying and utilizing around our household to make our life a little bit better. Um, I got a toy here, um, thanks to my, uh, my brother who turned me on to this item. Um, he has his own YouTube channel. It's technically Eric is his channel. I'll put a link to it. Um, he picked up this for to do some lawn work. This is a uh, electrical dethatcher. And you guys know what a dethatcher is. It's uh, something to help you get the dead grass. It's that season now. Uh, spring is in the air and now it's lawn care. All right, so. Um, Usually I will go to the store and rent the Thatcher for about a couple hours. Usually get four hour, half a day. And it's, you know, uh, a few dollars to uh, rent it. But the machine is heavy. Uh, you got to pick it up. You got to clean it. Um, you got to have the means and bring it to your house. Either a minivan or a pickup truck or something uh, to bring it. So, because it's quite heavy. And I always wanted to get my own the Thatcher for my lawn care, but one thing, they're very expensive. And number two, again, like I said the first time, they're very heavy. So my brother turned me on to this electrical one, which I didn't know they made electric uh, the Thatchers, but obviously they do. So I ended up picking up this up. This is the Greenworks um, the Thatcher. So all we're gonna do right now um, is do an open boxing. I ordered it yesterday and got it today from my favorite store, of course, Amazon. So let's just take a look at in the box and see what it's all about. Okay. We have our, uh, it's the Greenworks 14 inch, 10 amp electric thatcher. So you got your manual right here and it packs down very well. I, I, I must admit, most likely I'll probably end up keeping this box for storage, being that it's so small. Handle comes in two. Well, that's attached to it, so I guess this is one unit. And it's light, very light. All right, let's, put, let's throw that to the side. Here we have our replacement, the Thatcher, I guess, uh, teeth, I would call them. Here we have some uh, more parts, look like this for the handle. This is the unit, all right, it comes with the cord already attached to it, and there's another handle here. So I'm going to tell you right now, this thing is light, very, very light. Uh, and here's uh, the teeth here. So to give you an extra set to replace these, uh, which I like, uh, it's majority just plastic being light compared to a traditional one, how heavy it is. Um, looks good. Let's, uh, let me see if I can get you guys a little closer look at it. Hey right, guys, get you a little closer look at it. Right 
here you see some adjustment knobs right here and right here in relation to that those knob means As you can see, it's just attached to the handle. What I'm going to do now, I'm just going to simply uh, get this all connected. Again, we've got adjustments over here, over there again. This comes up for discharge. Here, this is just a rubber mat. mat. And this is how it looks underneath. This is all plastic. That's all plastic. And got the metal teeth to detach your grass. Alright, this is supposed to look, guys. Again, I just got this delivered I'm out early in the morning to get my lawn done so they give you extra packages of teeth right here and these are I guess for the handles all right and it's called green work all right, so let me just set up a little time lapse and put this together. And what I'm gonna do, I'll set up the camera because I'm gonna do my lawn right now. That's right there, and uh, see how this works out. All right, so let me just get this set up. guys when you put your handle in uh, it, it seems a little simple but you know there's a little technique to this all right when you put your thing on this handle on you got to put these spaces on now to make sure you're getting getting into the hole because there's only one hole that's already pre-drilled for you you're gonna have to lift your handle up like this all right slip your put your space it put your um your screw in and then when you look under here, you're able to see where that hole is to make sure you're not drilling in or making another new hole. All right, because you don't want a bunch of new holes all in this thing. All right, so I just want to bring that to your attention. It wasn't kind of clear in the directions, but that's a little trick. Get it in, force this down, put your spacer in, take your screw, lift up on the handle like so. So you give you a little space so you can look under and see where that hole is. So when the screw go in, you know you're getting that hole in. And once you got it there, then you can drill it down. That's it. All right, that's a little trick on getting that in because I was having a little trouble. If I didn't do that, you won't know if the screw was hitting that hole. So you, you have to pull those back, take a look at it, then drill your holes in. Give you a 
closer look. Uh, all right, in my opinion, with this uh this electrical thatch is pretty, it's all right. It's good for a hundred bucks. Um, I'm happy with it. All right. Um, as you can see, like all the thatch, not all of it, but you know a good majority of it is picked up off the grass. Um, let me see. Go on this end. Let me show you a little bit closer. All right. I don't know if you guys could tell this I haven't done this area and that's the area I did do and that's the, the thatch coming up so overall I'm, my opinion guys for a hundred bucks for this electrical thatcher is not a bad deal um, again if you're a prime member um, free shipping you can't go wrong so if you're looking for a uh, thatcher for your yard but uh, I recommend to pick this up now one thing I I should note all right these are your adjustment it says do not pull back when you're using this just just go forward with it and that's probably has to do because it's an electrical motor all right and that motor if you pull it back uh, you're gonna end up probably firing that motor so don't pull back just go forward with it all right and just go over it all right start out your high setting so you don't dig down too much into your grass and destroy it um, how it's set up in the box it's fine for me so I'm not gonna do any adjustments I'm just gonna leave it like it is um, to engage it you can simply you're gonna push this button in and when you push it in you raise up on this level and it goes right now it's nothing's happening but if I hold the handle I don't know if I can do this with one hand and push the button well push the button first I should say and then lift up on the handle and see it starts okay. and uh, again when you get to the end yes best bet if you don't want to stop the engine or the motor just lift up and turn lift the, the the blades off the grass and just turn as you go along so you don't destroy your lawn uh, but overall guys um, it's lightweight and it gets the job done all right I'm happy with it so what I'm gonna do I'm gonna continue to do my lawn do my lawn work here all right so that's it this is just a simply unboxing and review and closer look at the Greenworks electric electric the Thatcher um, again I got it for 105 free shipping I think it's uh, well worth the course all right, save you some money for if you want to do it yourself. All right, do your own lawn. All right, um, I got another item for the yard that's coming in. One of those uh, airy, airy. Ah, forget it. <laughs> anyway, check out for the next video. I got a couple more things yard related. All right, uh, once it comes in, I'll post a video on that. All right, guys. So, again, my opinion on this machine, I think it's it's well worth it. About for a hundred bucks. 105 all right free shipping you want to do that your own lawn it's well worth it it's lightweight uh it's a whole lot better handling than the, the, the traditional ones i used to rent at the uh two center all right those things are heavy uh just a pain to deal with this is very lightweight won't break your back and it does get the job done so i'm very happy with this purchase thanks for my brother for turning me on to this um i'll, I'll put a link for his channel Technically, Eric is his channel, um, a new YouTuber to the YouTube world, so go check out his channel. And guys, if you like this um, this video, please give me a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel. I got some more toys coming your way pretty soon, alright? Right, guys, be good out there, take care of your family, and I'll talk to you in the next one. Peace out.